welcome everyone. It actually kind of went dark, so I'm not really quite sure why the camera went dark. Maybe because I was having it all on all day, so it doesn't, uh, you know, if you have the screen on all day, you know, it will wreck it, so, and it can actually heat a lot of dust, and then that dust will bulk up, and then it gets real dusty. So, I turn it off. I, so I have, like, usually I have my tablet screen on, and then I have my computer screen on if I'm not using it, if I'm, like, recording videos or uploading something, because uploads have been terrible lately. How long they upload is ridiculous. So, anyway, uh, welcome YouTube. We are back, and we're playing Nox. Now, the last episode we did on Nox, we kind of passed everything we actually noticed that the game was made out of Spanish and not English, so that kind of wrecks the whole thing because I've already recorded it and uploaded it, the first part one, and this is now part two, and now we're dealing with Spanish writing. Like, I kind of effed up because I don't like if, like, I'm not a YouTuber who would play a game straight away and then like then delete that level and then make a new level because I'm making YouTube videos out of that level like I don't do that I do everything new because when I first came in this game I was like this is gonna be new but then I realized it was Spanish so that kind of um wrecks the game because if it's telling me to find a key or find something like I can't find it so I'm just trying to go through corners and stuff and well we're back we're back on this game and if you guys know what kind of language it is let me know in the comments down below because I'm confused now I've noticed this room right here does one of the levels in the game so I'm not sure if we're supposed to speak to this lady because, like, your boy can't find it. But then I found a chest, and it opens, and look, we get some, just gonna say health kit or juice box because I don't know, like, really what it is because it's... It's in different language, and I don't know what kind of language it is, but if I would love to know, like, I would find it on Google and try to find, like, what kind of Spanish this is. Now, I've noticed that there's actually... <sighs> At first, when I went through all the footage, when we went in this room last time, I thought these two chairs in the room were a chest, but it wasn't. <sighs> Yeah, so that kind of sucks. But then I realize we have an upstairs and we have a gem right here. And we collect it pretty much. So that kind of sucks, doesn't it? You press whatever slot you want. You can pick Borar, Gargar, or Gardar. And we're going to pick Gardar because that's one you have to pick pretty much. So when that's done, I think that's, oh, do we have to do it again? We have to do it again. I need water. Okay. Okay, so now I've just realized in my head that this area is a save slot. So if you're saving a game. So this is this is like a save lot menu, so you can see I can cancel it or accept it, so we can go accept, and it will save the game. And that's pretty much if you want to save your game, you just go to the gem. We got this weird thing in here I noticed last time. At first I thought it was just like a little party room with guys, but then until I see that thing in the middle... I'm like, how do we get in there? And that is actually, I think, the ending of the game. So when the game's completely finished, but we're not going to go to the ending because it's all in Spanish and I just want to do, like, this is the last video. So I don't want to make it 
you know, too long. I don't even have to use my mouse. You just use your WASD and then you enter and that's pretty much all the buttons you use. Now I've noticed that we can't get into this thing in the middle because that's the ending. So when the whole game's finished, that's when you can go in there and collect whatever's in there. But I've realized that when you go up here, and I checked in the last episode, that we can't come in here and that I never knew those stairs here. Because the game is like up here, like the camera where I am right here is looking down. So I can't tell if that's like a bookcase or a floor mat or something because of that view of that camera in the game. So, and I've noticed there's cracks in the floor, so that may be something inside the cracks of the floor. So we may check that out. Yeah, nothing. We now I've noticed that enough. This is, I think, the kind of the last thing I've noticed. This thing right here. This thing is obvious. It's gold. It's sharp. It's long. And I don't know if we need it. I don't know. I have no clue. But, um... So we can't come in here. She won't let us in. Um, so we can't get in there. So that kind of sucks. So we have to deal with the shit outside. Now I've noticed in the other last episode, there's something right here. Because I had to go through the whole footage just to find out what's out of the place. And I noticed there's a guard right underneath here. And I've noticed the last guard was on the other side, wouldn't let us in. And I thought, what happens if this guard lets, lets us go through? So we're going to check if he lets, go, lets us go through. And... Yeah. He's a bitch. <laughs> He's a bitch. Okay. That's weird. I never thought I could touch on graveyards. Um. Oh, actually. Oh, we can turn flashlights on and off. Okay. Never knew we could do that in that game. This game, that game, this game, just not worthy of doing stuff, you know? I don't know, I don't even know who that guy is with the blue jacket on. God or something? I'm not really sure. Is she letting us in? Wait. Weird. Is this... Wait, what the heck? This is... Weird. Okay, she just lets me go in her house. Oh, I didn't even know he was sitting there. I was like, is there someone in this room I may talk to just to find out their English, but they're all the different languages, and I can't tell if I should turn this to English. But there is no option for English. It's all just random words, or it's a different language. I don't have no, I have no idea. I'm confused. I'm speechless. Never knew this game would have been like this before. 
Oh, this looks obvious. What's this? A door? Staircase? A boat? No, I'm joking. It kind of does look like a boat, gotta say. Sea of Thieves. Yeah, there's... Oh, actually. I don't know. So this is, I'm guessing, a home? For the night? Oh, who's this guy? Doesn't want to talk, okay. Probably a slave or something. They do it in Skyrim, and I think it's kind of, you know, back then sort of feature. They all like being... Having random people. Oh, that's... I think that's the guy we have to talk to. The guy who's in the middle of that little lake area. We talked to that guy. We may get some information. Maybe he will talk this time. So let's check. So we will talk this time. Need to make sure which house he goes into. I'm not controlling this. Okay, we gotta meet up at the gravesite, okay. Ooh, this game. Ooh, I guess we're a little tiring. Why did I come this way? Wait, I'm coming, I'm coming, buddy, okay? I'm confused. <sighs> I have no clue. Okay, well... <laughs> yeah. Hang on a minute, chat. Okay, so that's... gonna be it for Nox. We're never gonna make another video like this, because it's... it's Spanish. And... I don't know... I don't know if it's Spanish... I have no clue. So I'm thinking of now, because we don't know it, what language it is, we can't really pass the game because it's in a different accent. And if it was English, we would play this every day, but this is going to be the last video of Nox. And so I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below. And um, I haven't said that in a long time, but this it was fun. But weird at the, it's weird at the exact same time because I don't know how to pass the levels. But um, I hope you guys do enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, everybody.